The current world dynamic continues to unfold in spectacular theatrical fashion. We are all challenged by the energetic forces and dynamics which work at keeping us in the extremes of polarity, kind of a reality of our 3D nature, right? It reminds us of the importance, though, of staying grounded and present within our heart so that we can anchor in light through emotions such as gratitude, forgiveness, and even acceptance. I'm Jackie Lara Herod, the Tigress of the Light. I'm a spiritual mentor, international best-selling author of multiple books, channeler, and developer of quantum healing modality, Fractaline Healing. Remember, if you like these videos, hit that like button, share, comment, subscribe, and remember to hit that bell as well so that you get notified when we release new content. There continues to be an excess of information, of varying reliability, being released into the collective, specifically to create the feelings of, my truth is better than your truth. We can observe this in our circles of friends and family, but we also see it circulating from the controlling narratives, fear propaganda, legacy news media, and so on. Much of what we consume from multimedia sources perpetuates high emotional responses by triggering people through these news and events. Even comments, right? These energies are captivating. They're addictive. They keep us reaching for our popcorn as we settle in further to watch the show. We feel a complex assortment of excitement, guilt, anger, frustration, and fear as we swipe through our phones, TVs, and computer screens for our next addictive fix. What we wish to remind you is that things aren't often as bad as they seem. Yes, there is definitely some hard and difficult truths that we all must face, but not everything we hear and see is going to be accurate. Some of what we hear, hear and see is sourced from an opinion, an emotional-based report, maybe something that went viral, and was created perhaps by someone who didn't even have the full set of facts. The task for all of us lightworkers is to be clear enough within our own self that we can discern where the truth lies in every story and report that we see. Much of the narrative that we see today originates from a single source, which trickles down through stories and various outlets, each with their own spin on the same story. Why? Because it keeps us distracted, addicted, divided, and in fear-based control. Why? Because there's money to be made that way. The good news is, you're wise to it. You have the inner authority and power to manage your emotions and inner world. You can choose to put down your phone and go outside. You can choose to respond differently. Find the neutrality within the greater wisdoms of your heart center. Remember, there are at least nine different perspectives and truths in every circumstance. From the place of neutrality, we can gain greater perspective and acceptance. That's where we find the nine different angles, by the way, is through neutrality. We gain insights as to what we should do or how we should respond. Neutrality offers us space to share in others' opinions while honoring and supporting their truths, their perspectives, and their own reasonings. Holding this level of love within your being encourages others to do the same. Something that we really need to go viral now. Not only are you making your life better, but you're making and showing others who are struggling that there is another option. I believe this is the way forward into the new world as we all bear witness to the old one crumbling all around us. This isn't something to be feared. It's actually something to be rejoiced. You are part of the new world, the creation and manifestation of this new world. You have a say in what happens here. But it is up to you to be in tune with your own being and to take responsibility for your own energy. We are so lucky actually to be living in this dynamic time. 
I know you've heard spiritualists say this, but it is true. We are all supported by spirit more than we can ever know. And there are infinite resources and support lines available for each of us. So we ask you once again, what is the world you are manifesting? Hey everybody, thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you have found this helpful and inspiring. We truly do have a say in what is unfolding before us because we have a say over our own energy. It all comes back to energy and it's your body that's going to be the creator of the energy on this plane. So even if you hear people talking about 5D and moving into 5D, you're not leaving your physical body. Your physical body is still with you. You're manifesting though through the energy of your heart center. In order to do that, we do need to be in tune with our heart center and we need to find neutral. We need to understand this neutral space. This is where you're going to have the most power. This is where you're going to have the most acceptance. This is where you're going to have the most fun. We're not going to be sitting in fear. We're going to be going after what we want, what our heart calls us to do, what our love calls us to do. And if you can imagine everyone doing that, wow, what a world it would be. Well, it starts with you and it starts with me. So let's do our part and let's hold the good space for everybody and show people how simple it is. We can do this. I know we can. If you've enjoyed this video, remember like, share, comment, subscribe, hit that bell so you get notified when we get new ones out. And if you have a topic suggestions for me, please let me know in the comments below. And we also do light language channeling. So if you have a topic that you would like me to channel for light language, make sure you leave that also in the comments below. Remember that my best-selling books are huge, huge helps for the energies that we're dealing with right now. So if you haven't checked those out, do check those out. They help us to align to the good energies. They help our minds. They help our bodies or souls. They really work on all levels of the being and they're very, very powerful yet very gentle. They're super sweet, you guys. So remember, you can check those out if you're looking for a little more assistance or if you're looking to level yourself up because you want to stand more firmly in your self-mastery. Until we see you again, wishing you the most amazing, wonderful, and fantastic week. All blessings.